now that we've finished all of our planning, it's time for us to get started with the really exciting stuff. So the method that I've ultimately chosen to recommend for restaurant website creation is called Squarespace. You can head over to www.squarespace.com to follow along with me right now. Now, today there really are a lot of options for website builders and content management systems that let you customize templates without touching any code. And it's great that things have come far enough that we have so many options. For me, it really came down between Squarespace and WordPress, which you might have heard of before or even tried out. I ended up choosing Squarespace over WordPress for a couple of reasons. Number one, WordPress is first and foremost a blogging platform. It's really customizable and it definitely can be used to make all kinds of other websites. But its bones are a blogging platform, and that means that it can take some finagling to make it work for another kind of website, which I find can be really confusing for someone who's just starting out. On top of that, in my experience, it can be pretty easy to make a WordPress website look, let's say, less than beautiful if you don't know what you're doing. Squarespace, on the other hand, is much more direct. It's a bit less customizable than WordPress, but the benefit of that is that it's almost impossible to screw up. I've never once seen a really ugly Squarespace site, or even a broken one. For beginners, that's a huge benefit, and that's my reasoning behind choosing it for this project. So we arrive at squarespace.com, and right off the bat, we see some of the beautiful examples of websites that it can create right over here. And bonus points, if we scroll down, we can see that it actually caters directly to restaurants. That's great, right? It's awesome to have that kind of attention built right in. And as we get started, you'll see that it'll make things a lot easier for us. Okay, so let's rock and roll. Let's head up over here and click on that Get Started button. Right away, it dumps us into template selection. You can go ahead and pause and take the time to look through all of these, but I've already chosen my favorite ahead of time. I'm going to be working with Pacific right here, but I think that all of these are pretty great choices and your process will pretty much be the same no matter what you pick. All right, so let's go ahead and fill out this sign up form. Now they're going to ask me some questions about my restaurant. What's great about this is that you'll see in a few minutes that they'll use this information and make the template automatically customized to what I need, which will actually end up saving us a lot of time later on. Give me a few minutes to fill this stuff out and feel free to follow along and fill out your own information as I do this. All right, and that's all it takes. We've still got quite a bit of customizing to do, but you can see that they did a lot of the work for us. We're at a great starting point. So let's take a break now, and then in the next video, we'll work on putting in all of our content. Mm -hmm.